Hard hitting sports in your face. All right, so this uh, story is all over the news media right now. Um, former Miami Dolphin uh, Jonathan Martin uh, posts on his page. Um, he tags James Dunleavy. I don't know who that is. I think this guy is Jamar Taylor, um, Richie Incognito, and Mike Pouncey. Um, and he says, when you're a bully victim and a coward, your options are suicide or revenge. Um, he hashtags Howard Westlake and Miami Dolphins. Um, now, Jonathan Martin uh, was on the team. Um, this was all, if, if you go back a few years ago, um, there was a huge scandal that went down with the Dolphins. Um, and I always thought uh, the reason why this all happened is because the team found out that Jonathan Martin was a gay dude. I always thought that um, the details have never come out. Um, but I, that's what I've always thought is that uh, he was a gay dude and they were picking on him in the locker room. Um, the, the reason, and, and then like, I think Richie Incognito left like a message on his uh, voicemail or some shit saying he pissed in his mouth or some shit. But yeah, this is the article that's going on on TMZ. Um, ex uh, NFL player who is at the center of the Miami Dolphins bullying scandal has been detained by police after he allegedly posted a disturbing photo of gun um, ammo in the name of ex NFL teammates. Um, the post first appeared on Martin's Instagram page showing an image of a shotgun surrounded by ammunition with the caption. I um, already read that to you. Um, he listed uh, social media handles. Uh, for ex Dolphins teammates Richie Incognito and Mike Pouncey. Um, Martin also posted the name of his high school, his former high school, Harvard Westlake, one of the most exclusive private schools in the country. Harvard Westlake closed the school in the wake of the threats, telling students to stay off campus in an abundance of, of, of caution. Now, this all comes um, just days after um, the shooting of all of those high school kids. Um, Jonathan Martin is obviously not in the uh, right mental uh, mind frame right now to even think about doing something like this, posting a picture of a gun um, and then tagging a high school just days after all of those high schools got, all those high school kids got killed. Um, law enforcement tells TMZ Sports, um, the individual we believe to be responsible for social media posts has been detained. An investigation is ongoing. Um, of course, Martin, I'm um, accused incognito and Pouncey of physically and emotionally abusing him um, during his stint with the Miami Dolphins in 2013. Um, the players claim they were just harmlessly hazing Martin. The NFL conducted an investigation and ruled uh, that Martin was indeed harassed. So, uh, yeah, this is about a former Dolphin doing weird shit. And I think the reason why he was doing weird shit is because um, he was bullied. Uh, because I think I, I really, honestly, I've never seen a situation like that. I've seen hazing happen before. Um, I, I always thought that this dude, you know, that that that's just that's just me. That's all. I've always thought he was gay. I thought that was the reason why they were picking on this guy. Um, it doesn't make it a, a, a right situation, but that's how I looked at it. And I, I said I made a, a post about this situation a while back, um, and I, I stated that in the video that I thought that was the reason why Jonathan Martin um, was getting picked at in the locker room. Um, anyway, folks, I got a couple other videos um, that I have to put up, and um, we'll go a few things. Uh, the NFL Combine is next month. Um, you will see Dolphin fan voices uh, next month as we discuss um, the NFL Combine, we get with the guys um, and we'll, we'll talk about the NFL Combine, um, some of the things we like. Uh, the NFL Combine will probably happen during times when I'm at work. So um, we'll, I'll try to record those things or have um, someone else who's not at work at that particular time um, record it and kind of send it to me so I can uh, definitely check it out um, and have some interesting con um, content about the NFL draft, uh, and then we'll go into 
or about the NFL Combine, and then we'll go into the NFL Draft, um, and then we will uh, talk about free agency and all those good things that happen as we steer quickly uh, towards the 2018-2019 season. Um, shit, we're already almost at the end of February. Uh, February will be over in five fucking days. These, these months are just uh, cruising by. And before we know it, we'll be, be right back to football season. So, yeah. Um, if you're not on my Facebook page, man, make sure that you add my Facebook page. Make sure you join, um, add me on Twitter. Uh, my Twitter handle um, is at casual, at K-S-U-W-E-L-L. I am out of here. Um, peace.